Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is JT from Blow, Blow the Boat. I want to talk about Amir Khan. Amir Khan. He uh, came to a decision. Uh, he's going to uh, fight uh, Terrence Crawford uh, more likely in April the 20th at uh, Madison Square Garden. And, um, well, I was reading an article and um, it said something about Amir Khan. Uh, probably, I think it seemed like he, could, he, he probably could have got more money and. Um, and well, a bigger crowd as if because he would have fought in. I mean, if he would have fought at uh, in Europe, um, in the Wibbling Stadium, he could have got more, probably more money fighting uh, Carol Brook. You know what I'm saying? But the thing about it is the difference. The difference is because of the pay per view in, uh, in uh, I think, what in London? I'm thinking um, it would have. Um, he would have to split that with Carol Brook, but see with uh, Crawford, he don't have to. He don't have to split that with uh, with uh, Chance Crawford if is because it's going to be on pay per view, y'all, which. To me, I'm kind of, I'm kind of, I mean, a pay per view fight, man, with Khan, man. I mean, if he didn't have no loss, if he had one loss, maybe, and, and then he would have beat the people that, those elite pe uh, opponents that he was, um, that he fought, it would have been a pay per view. This would be a big pay per view event, but, I mean, it could be on pay per view all they want, all, all, I mean, which is going to be, but I just don't think that, you know, saying, I mean, of course, I don't, I don't think it's going to do better than Mikey Garcia and Errol Spence. And, and another thing, too, at the same time, um, I mean, uh, I mean, I'm, I, my, you know, one thing is, I'm going to say this. Um, it seemed like they build, they try to build up, of course, they're trying to build up, Top Rankers try to build up uh, Chance Crawford uh, because Errol Spence is going to be on pay per view. And, uh, and then after that fight, if, if Errol Spence beat. Mikey Garcia, more. I mean, it looked like he's going. He might fight Manny Pacquiao, which is a, another pay per view superstar. They building up Errol Spence, which uh, PBC should. I mean, that, that's what you should. That's what you should do with your, um, with your investments. I would say, yo, you know, you know, what I'm saying so. Um, but the thing about it is, Chance Crawford is trying. They trying to build him too. Um, to win, whereas in Errol Spence and Chance Crawford will end up in the middle, and then they had to negotiate, which will be who's the A side and the B side. So, you know, the thing about it is, I think Errol Spence is going to come out with, he's going to come out on the A side. I mean, when they do meet up, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just being serious with that. I know he can't get no fights over there in, in PBC, but more likely, I think it's easy to make that fight over there because they over there. Terrence Crawford, it's hard to make a fight with opponent. It's hard to make a fight with people that's in your stable, but and, and then you definitely when you cross the street in a different company, it's definitely going to be um, uh, a little bit difficult. You know what I'm saying? So um, <coughs> I just see uh, Errol Spence coming out being the ASAP if they do meet up, <coughs> which they will <coughs> um, <coughs> whenever they meet up. <coughs> Excuse me, <coughs> but um, but the thing about it is. Um, yeah, I think this is gonna. I think this is gonna be a, a interesting fight. Uh, even though Khan got a loss, but it's all about it's all about uh, uh, coming back and uh, who who are you now after the losses? Who can you be? You know, say so are you gonna be better than uh, 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 after the losses than than you was before the losses? You know, what I'm saying so. That's what it's all about being a, a, a box two at the same time. So, but Mayweather might have a different uh, story. Uh, uh, say so about that, <laughs> but uh, getting back to um, getting back to uh, uh, Amir Khan uh, making a decision to fight uh, Terrence Crawford. Um, it's going to be at Madison, Madison Square Garden, and um, and the thing too at the same time when I was looking at um, Danny Garcia, he said, I mean, I'm in, I'm with Terrence Crawford, and uh, I think Bob Aaron. Was offering uh, Danny Garcia a three million dollar contract. I mean, you know, saying three million dollar guarantee uh, China, to Chance Crawford. Um, and Angel uh, Garcia, uh, Danny's Danny's father trainer, never responded to never responded to top ranks offer. However, which made Aaron Teen explode other uh, uh, opponents. You know one thing is, I remember I made a video about that, and I remember I said uh, Chance uh, Gar. Uh, Gar uh, Danny Garcia was right. Uh, he he was the. Uh, I think he was right about if you don't if you didn't talk to him, um, if you talk if you I mean if you didn't talk to Bob Aaron, I mean if you didn't talk to Al Heyman, then that mean that it's not you're not serious whatever and all that. I you know what I kind of I'm about to take that back right now. I think Danny got I think Danny Garcia already came out. He already got two losses already. He know if he fight Terrence Crawford, it could be another third loss. Um, 
You know, one thing about Terrence Crawford and Danny Garcia, I mean, of course, their styles are different. Danny Garcia is kind of, he's kind of stackling. He's kind of fat-footed a little bit. Crawford is not. So, I mean, I know they, they, they fought in the amateurs and uh, Terrence Crawford won and Dan, Danny Garcia won. But that's the amateurs. Uh, I thought he, I think, I thought he would not be afraid to uh, fight Terrence Crawford since he somewhat uh, beat him in the amateurs. So, but if they offer you three million dollars and you didn't take that, you know, saying uh, I, I wonder how much he was getting fighting the other fighters, uh, Danny, Danny Garcia. You know, said so was it three million? Was it two million? And if, if if it was, then I don't know why you didn't take this offer. Because even though it might it might not be for Al Heyman, but I thought you was your own boss to a certain degree. You know what I'm saying? You know, uh, over there, you more freely to do what you want to do, to talk to whoever you want to talk to, to a certain to a certain degree. I would say, uh, Danny Garcia, especially he, this is somewhat run his own career. I, I, I would say that, but at the same time, I think that was just an excuse to not want to fight Terrence Crawford because he came off with a loss with Sh Sean Porter. Another loss will put him, he he put him at the at the at the end of the line. You know what I'm saying? He was at he was at he was almost at the. Uh, uh, in the the beginning of the line, but now he almost at the end of the line. If he come out with a, come out with another loss, he'd be at the, he'd be almost at the end of the line. Had to start off from uh, point A to point B again to a certain degree. You know what I'm saying? And the reason why uh, 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 Bob Aaron wanted that uh, fight because it would have been that would have been that fight would have been on pay, it would be on pay per view and it would have been I think a. I think th I think with Danny Garcia, if Terrence Crawford would have fought Danny Garcia on pay per view, that would have been a. I think, I think that would have been a bigger pay per view. I think because Amir Khan is from London, Danny Garcia is from America. He got you know uh, the Puerto Ricans going to back him to a certain degree. I mean, of course, other Americans going to back um, Danny Garcia because you know uh, you know he is American. You know, what I'm saying we always call, keep on calling somebody. Like Chance Crawford might be black, but he's American, and and, and and Danny Garcia. But you know, we know how you know we know how it is over here in America, segregated to to a, to a certain degree. I mean, it's getting it's it's a lot better than, of course, in the seventies. But still, I mean, Americans don't port Americans don't port they uh, fighters like uh, like people from London. It don't matter what color you are, black, white, Arab, Asian, whatever. You know what I'm saying, or whatever, African, whatever. You know what I'm saying. They 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 support it. if you're in London, you was born in London, they support you. And that's one thing I like about London, but over here in America, it's, it's totally different. But uh, getting back to this, um, the thing about it is, man, um, this, I think it's, it's, it's going to be an interesting fight. I mean, he, I mean, I mean, I, I don't think right now, as I think about, it, I think Khan made the right decision. It don't, you know what? If, even if he didn't, even if he didn't pick Chance Crawford, if he picked uh, Kerr Brook, you know, what I'm saying they would have. Um, I think that would have been a good decision too. You know, both of them are good fighters. I mean, I know. Uh, see, one thing about uh, Kel Brook, he fought um, um, Errol Spence and uh, Triple G and lost. You know, of course. You know what I'm saying? So those are two uh, elite fighters. You know what I'm saying? It's, you know what I'm saying? But um, well, you could call them elite, whatever you want to call it, because they, of course, they, their names are out there. But they don't mean they're really elite. Because Triple G, he he fought people or. Uh, Coming up on weight, you know what I'm saying, and our opponents in not so much the elite uh, middleweight, and uh, and Errol Spence haven't fought the fighters. He he haven't got no big names on his res uh, his resume instead of uh, instead of uh he got uh Carol Brook and that's it. Everybody else is really really somewhat irrelevant, you know what I'm saying. So um, but it, that it, that can go back and forth with that. But anyway, but the thing about it is with Carol Brook, man, um, um. I think I think fight Chance Crawford. If he do beat him, if he do beat him, because I think he still got a chance. I don't think Chance Crawford hit harder than uh Canel Canelo Alvarez, or he hit harder than uh Carol Kel Brook. I think if 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 Chance if if, if, if Amir Khan uh, beat Crawford, I think it probably be a rematch too at the same time. I'm not stupid because I think Errol Spence he would he would want a rematch after if 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 Mike Garcia beat him, but. I think if Amir Khan beat uh, Chance Crawford, he probably will fight uh, Kyle, Kyle Brook. But I think if Chance Crawford beat uh, Amir Khan, he should fight uh, 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 Kyle Brook. That would be another big. Uh, 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 that, I think that'd be on pay per view too. They they should look into that. You know, what I'm saying they, if they can't get Danny Garcia, which he he said he 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 
he came up with a, uh, an excuse saying that if it ain't uh, if you didn't talk to Al Hammer, then it don't really mean nothing. Which I I disagree with that. Now I remember I agree with that, but I disagree with that now. I think he didn't want the fight because it's a possibility he might lose that fight, and he had three uh, losses on his record, and he would have to get back at the end of the line now. He'd be at the end of the line and start to start from uh, point A to B, point B, like I said already. But um, what do y'all guys think about Maricon changing his mind and, and wanting to fight Chance Crawford instead of Carol Brook? Do you think he do you think he got a chance to win it, or do you think um, he made a mistake? He should have fought Carol Brook, and um, yeah. So hit the um, leave a comment at the bottom of my page, subscribe to my page, like my page, hit the bell icon for new notification, new videos for me. This is JT from Bubble Blow the Belt. All right, bye.